What's up guys, it's me Prince from the Tech Prince and I know it's been a while since I last uploaded a video and that's due to a whole bunch of factors but you know what, 2016 is here and I want to start uploading this channel again. So you know what, let's roll the intro and get right into this video and I'll tell you about everything coming up this year. Now as I said before the intro rolled, a big thing last year is that there was a huge pause for my videos in the last couple of months and I'm very sorry about that. And the main reason for that is college application season really approached and that was crazy for me. If you don't know, I'm a senior in high school and so there's a whole bunch of stuff going on right now. I'm pretty much done my college applications. Now I'm just doing some scholarship apps, I'll be done with those soon. And so the last couple of months I haven't had a whole lot of time to shoot and edit video. So hopefully that's going to be, re I'm trying to redeem that this year and start off 2016 right and hopefully for the next, uh, the next couple of weeks at least, I'm going to try and upload videos on a weekly basis, see how that goes and then at the end of the, by probably mid year, I'll probably make a decision if I want to keep going with one video a week or maybe double or maybe change that schedule in some way. Uh, uh, just so, but right now is really just going to be a time to test the waters. I don't have an exact day when I'll be uploading videos every week, so just be checking your YouTube sub boxes, a great reason to subscribe to my channel if you haven't already. Uh, so just check your sub boxes, I'll be uploading hopefully once a week, and I'll be covering a whole bunch of different cool tech products, just as the channel did before. The next thing I want to cover in this video is my camera gear. If you can't tell, hopefully this video looks a whole bunch better compared to my old camera which was the Sony DSC HX20V which while it was a good camera, in the end of the day it was a point and shoot. It wasn't made for video. My big Christmas gift for the year was a new camera and that's where uh, they picked me up this, the Panasonic Lumix G7. Now this is a 4K camera so if you can't tell though, sadly this video is not in 4K and that's because I just got in so I'm working with it. I'm not sure though, in the next couple of months I may up grade and start using 4k video but as of now I'm shooting in 4k down sampling it to 1080p and uploading it to YouTube that way just so I can have shorter upload times but hey in the next couple of weeks if you guys really start requesting it I may make the jump to 4k and just start recording and uploading in 4k and one of the big things is that I was on sale and so I was able to pick up a shotgun mic with it and a couple of other accessories. So currently the audio on this video should sound different and that's because I'm shooting with the Rode Video Mic Go. It's a shotgun mic and it's much different from my old setup which is a con which was a condenser microphone, the MXL 770, which is still a great condenser microphone and actually will still use in some videos. But I just want to tell you in a lot of other videos when I don't see it necessary, I'll probably be using this system because it's a whole lot easier to shoot videos and that should help me upload videos more frequently because it's less things I have to set up and let that which means less uh, less time in between videos so hopefully you guys think it sounds good if not though leave a comment down below and on that note I'm gonna draw this video to an end hopefully you enjoyed it and if you did please give it a big thumbs up down below as that really shows your support for the channel and really helps me out also, speaking of all those big upgrades and changes in video quality and all this new stuff coming with the channel, uh, definitely subscribe because this is an awesome time. You'll be getting a whole lot more videos in your sub box from me, so definitely subscribe. And if you are sus subscribed already, continue on. Uh, also, if you didn't like the video though, feel free to dislike it, but hopefully you can leave a comment telling me what I should do to increase the video quality or make it even better next time. So hopefully you guys enjoyed this video. It's been me, Prince, from the Tech Prince. See ya. And we're back. So now I want to talk to you guys about the conclusion of this review. And I know probably a lot of you guys are sitting there wondering, scratching your heads, thinking like, why are you reviewing a one or two year old graphics card prints? It makes no sense to provide a review for something that old. 